Morning. We are at Flamingo Lands. This is proving to be a very interesting morning. Uh, we are here with the good people of Marshall Honda and the power of dreams to make a couple of dreams come true uh, for two people this morning. Um, this is Roger. Hello, Roger. Good morning. It's been an interesting one, hasn't it? It's been an adventure already. <laughs> we'll, we'll edit out all that's happened before. We'll pretend this is all we'll kind on. of live and happening straight away. But there's been a bit of a mix-up regards where we're all meeting this morning. But anyway, um, we're going to give a couple of surprises to people here at Flamingo Land and hopefully, hopefully make it a great day for them and make their dreams come true. Um, we're just waiting for Amelia. Amelia. Oh, is that Amelia? Hello. Good morning. Hello, Amelia. I just shake your hands. I like your gloves, very nice. Oh, matching boots as well. Um, my name's Tom from Yorkshire Coast Radio, mm -hmm. and we do this thing called Dream Maker. It's about making dreams come true for people, and we do this with uh, good gentlemen like these. This is hey, Roger from Roger. Marshall Honda and you? the Power of Dreams. And do you know what we're going to say next? That you're actually here to have a dream come true. Because I believe that you like animals. Yeah, and you might like, when you're a bit older, you might like to actually work with animals and look after them. So how do you fancy spending a day behind the scenes, right up close, looking after the animals as a zookeeper? Dig yes. in, and having a full day of it. <laughs> I can tell by your eyes, that's, 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 that's good, isn't it? You've got your wellies already, so does that sound like a good surprise, a good dream come true? Yeah. It's all yours. You look a little bit strong. It's your, day. <laughs> your day. Your wellies are gonna get a bit mucky. You're going to be going around and enjoying Flamingo Land and all the zoo. Sound good? Have a high five. Thank you very much. And we're going to come with you for a little bit and film you so you've got that as a kind of little um, memento of your day here. OK? Smiley, smiley. <laughs> good, good. Sure fantastic Keep the camera news. running because this is a double whammy today. We'll switch you just a second. A double whammy. If you spin it round, we've already met Phil, but this is Phil. Hi again, Phil. Hi. It's been an interesting morning with morning. Phil. Uh, Roger's already met Phil as well, but Phil, this man, this man spends so much all time. of his time, just so much time, looking after his family, um, and that's that's your wife and uh, the youngsters as well. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's yeah. a full-time job looking after them because you know they've got a, a, a few problems in life. That's right. Yeah, um, I have two disabled children, and my wife's disabled as well. Right. Still comes a lot of his time to the dialer ride as well, which is yeah, that's fantastic. Right. In your free time, you're helping other people as well. So this this is just amazing. So your daughter, Kat, who's lurking somewhere, <laughs> there she, she's over there, uh, she wrote into Yorkshire Coast Radio, The Power of Dreams with Marshall Hunter, and said, could we uh, maybe give Phil a little bit of time to himself to do something that he really enjoys? And apparently that involves... Monkeys. Monkeys. <laughs> he likes monkeys and apes and all, and all gorillas, that. Gorillas. Gorillas. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so we thought you might like to get really up close, uh, put your wellies on as well, and meet some monkeys and, and gorillas brilliant. close up. Sound good? Yeah. Brilliant. Brilliant. Oh, we have a fantastic day. And, and this day is just for you. Hopefully it's a little dream that we're making come true and yeah. uh, you'll remember this for a few years to come. Yeah. So it's thanks to Marshall Honda, the power pleasure. of Absolute dreams. Absolute pleasure. And guys, have a great day. Hope you Thank get you. your wellies nice and mucky and you remember this for many years to come. Well, this is yeah. the lovely Linda from, uh, <laughs> from Flamingo Land Zoo. Uh, just tell us a little bit about what the team's going to be up to today because uh, you're starting the tour and the behind the scenes side of things here. Um, so what are they going to experience over the next couple of hours? Well, first of all, we're going to go down and feed the penguins. Yes. I so hope you'll quite enjoy that. And then you'll be passed on to the children's farm where you'll be getting the ducks out. We're going to be some up and out, etc. So I hope you're feeling nice and strong. And then later in the day, you'll be meeting the tapirs and the lemurs, right. going down Hello. to see the big cats, yep. uh, <laughs> maybe giving the giraffes a bit of browse, having a stroke with the rhinos as they still come up, yeah. with a fence in between, of course. So, uh, yes, and you mentioned the lemurs. Thing you'll be doing. So this is going to keep our Phil happy. Oh, it certainly And will. he's going to be able to get really close up to these guys. Yes, he really, he'll really get close. He'll probably jump on him and all sorts. He'll be feeding them. And, Sound okay. good, Phil? We'll be all over. Sounds good. So, uh, Sounds good. Sounds good. Certainly enjoy that. Make sure you take some photos because we're going to have to go back to work soon. But <laughs> some photos and send them to us in the next couple of days and hopefully we can witness all this happening close up. And what's, what, 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 these breakfast. are actually straps, yes. Yeah, straps for breakfast straps. down here. These are um, the penguins' favourite food. All right. Yeah. On to the first of them then. Okay then.